time was, I guarded the Celestial River with my boys 80,000 strong, and the puny revenants dare to impede me. That grand transformation of mine was the only reason you're still standing here. A proper kneel to show gratitude would be appropriate, no? Fooled me once, never again. Deceptive tactics like this pose no threat. I'll go size them up first. Keep pace, boy. Nowhere, the 
whole mountain was infested with those stinking corpses. Some coffin carts blocked all the passes up, burning everything in their path. You seem clever. How about you find a way to destroy them, eh? They're called Five Element Carts, an evil and powerful invention of the King's Son. I'm afraid they're not only guarding the passes. Trust me, there's more to it. Got to hold my ground at the entrance for a while. Can't imagine the chaos without me. They're called Five Element Carts, an evil.
quite the charmer, aren't you, boy? But these eyes have seen prettier disguises. Yao Guai! Your true face! Out with it! If a single lie slips, my rake shall strike true! <laughs> that was so close. Thank you for saving me. I am the Bull King's daughter, Ping Ping. Oh, nonsense! The Bull has no daughter! Dare to fool me, scoundrel! <laughs> I, I know who you are! My mother is Princess Fairfox. You killed her! After my mother died, I've been living with my father. His wife, Princess Rikshasi, took me in as her own. Later, brother came back from Bodhisattva Guan Yin, and we reunited. We had some peaceful days. My brother was kind, to me and to our parents. But somehow, not long ago, he suddenly changed. He secretly summoned his old troops for a coup. Imprisoned father, kept mother under strict watch. I... I had nowhere else to turn. I had to go for help. But barely after leaving the place, his minions fell upon me. <laughs> the Bull King's might is known. Even together, Wukong and I couldn't rival him. Rakshasi's plantain fan is also formidable. And you want me to believe that they were subdued by a kid? Subdued by their son? Who else could make them put their guard down? Really, with soft hearts, they could never harm him. You idiot! This fox is fooling you! Look at this place! Only my brother's Samadhi fire could wreak such havoc! Oh no. My father is dying. Please, kind monkey, help me and my family! A perilous place this is. Keep this cicada safe with you. It'll come in handy. That's a voice I know well. I'll go ahead and take a look. No time to lose now! Follow me! This way! Did Master Pig whisper to you just now? I've let go of our blood feud, but he still holds so much hostility. My brother's minions are everywhere. Stay close to me, kind monkey. Brother and I used to play around there. The Valiant Six had their ways of amusing us. What fun we had together. I'll get through this hole, and you can pass by that track ahead. Mother Samadhi fire has obstructed all paths uphill. To quench it, Mother's plant and fan is a must. But she'd never. What? Come with me! What? What? this clip. 
Madeline, there is a secret passage to her palace. She should be there, but she'd never give you the fan to be used against her precious son.
desire for the complete and final cessation. My life for the cards' demise. I deem it worthy. If you can't free me from his evil, you should walk away. From death roots life, and from life, death. I should have discerned his malice, since I've bid farewell with kind words. You should depart now. My body has been exposed. I beg you to leave my soul in peace. Go. Take the whip now, and my soul shall scatter. I implore you to stop. Life has been much. I should let go. I cannot rest in peace. Before my body is freed from darkness. My past is much. I should let go.
I tolerate no evil under my nose. Neither does my axe. Bring me more revenants so I can chop them up. Heed my words. The Red Boy's carts are nothing more than a distraction. Thinks he can outwit me. <laughs> bah! That brat! <sighs> Make haste and head up the mountain. We must figure out what he's planning. Hmm. They are called Five Element Cards for a reason.
<laughs> Wanted monkey! Wanted star! Wanted dead or alive! <laughs> Halt! Intruders! To the Princess Palace face! Yeah. <laughs> 
comfort does this heart implore? A humble drink, its solace I adore. A fine brew deserves a fitting gourd. Here, take this. The Bull King accepted his destiny, but there are others who refuse to do the same. Family strife confounds even the wisest. Why should we meddle? With the full gourd's draught by my side, let cares drift away into the tide. The Bull King accepted his destiny, but there are others who refuse to do the same. Family strife with the full gourd. Oh! <laughs> 
Ada safe with you. You'll come in handy. Enough about your brother. If you care for him so much, why not go back to him and give me some peace? If you want that, brother, then I implore you to lend me your quantum fan to save father. Save him? Or this mountain from his doom? Both are beyond this plan. Mother, please, I am begging you. Father's life hangs on a thread. A thread which brother could cut short any moment. Since when did you start caring for that old bull? Do you not think you can hide your secret wish from me? You wish you could rule this mountain with your brother once we are finished. If you won't act, Mother, then I implore you to... to lend me your plant and fan to save Father. <sighs> Words from cunning foxes. You just want to trade my fan for a smile on your brother's face. I... I owe my life to Father. And to your kindness for taking me in. Brother was good to me, but I would never betray my parents for him. Say no more of the fan. We raised the boy. Guess this is what we deserve. But you... Why are you here at this very moment? Rakshasi, I'm not a part of your family, and I'm aware I have no voice in this. But Ping told me the Destined One had arrived. <laughs> the Destined One, who doesn't even know what he's destined for. Those old bastards must have pulled a muscle coming up with the name. You and I both know who he truly is. When the time comes, your children, your husband, and even this very palace could all turn to ashes. What do I have to fear from a mere pawn? He's no match for us. He can't even rival the power of my fan. Once the truth is revealed, suddenly he is here. Do you not find it odd? Such a twist of fate. The truth? The truth of what? Who are you talking about? I heard the Destined One had obtained all the other relics. Rakshasi, your situation is grave. Do you not see who mandated his return? Were those relics really bestowed for your good? Perhaps amid these schemes and plots, we've unwittingly become stepping stones for his rebirth. For others, I care not. All along, you are all I care for. I say we should leave together. I vow to treasure you dearly, just like when we're up there. I never thought that one day you'd be the only one I can rely on. I am overwhelmed. Come, sit with me, and tell me what to do. Don't let him, Mother! Don't you see? He is taking advantage of you! You lecher! I called for your help, not your treachery! How, how dare you! A child of a concubine should know better manners. When I first crossed paths with her, your bull of a father was no more than livestock, munching on a patch of grass. Have you no shame? Mother, don't be fooled! Enough of your endless prattle. Hmm. <laughs> now, that's better. Rakshasi, have we not been this close since our time in Tushita Palace? Well, yes, I do miss the old days, too. We were so happy back then. What's in the blazes? No, no tricks, tricks here. here. It's, it's just, just my, my hoof. hoof. You, you deserve, deserve to know, to know before we kiss. You will live to repent this! Filthy uh, lowlife! You dare take her form and beguile me! My old friend, wasn't it fun? 
Have we not been this close since our carnage in the fox den? <laughs> you abhorrent fraud! My candid words were wasted on your foul ears! Candid, my hoof! Your revenants are everywhere! I thought you'd have better lies! Quick on your heels, huh? Well then, boy, let us teach this brazen adulterer a lesson. Vile beast! Your savagery knows no cure! But you will behave once my sourceless water from Toshita drops. I've aided your journey once. Now I shall aid you again on your way to death. From yin and yang arises two sides. From land and sky emerges the divide. Now you shall be feasted upon by my yin yang fish. What a stingy host! Such a meager fish. Hardly enough for a platter.
Disasters are sure to follow. The turmoil you witness is but a ripple caused by a drop from above. <laughs> Bad news after a good nap. <laughs> He's gone too far from a furnished servant. A decent lad he was. <sighs> decent until ruined by brother Wukong. Then destiny carried him further to fall for the wrong woman. <laughs> This way. Check if any way leads up. I'll go look around. The owner might be gone, but her treasure might still be there.
What a great fight! <laughs> You see how I swung my axe? <laughs> Someone fed that unruly boy a load of nonsense, and now he's running amok. Why doesn't the king take action? With his might, he could take down ten red boys. I can see the king from here. Stripped of his mount and weapon. I wonder what's behind all this. What else is hidden in this mountain? Or I, I feel blind. Blind. We should find the king's mount first. The Bishwi beast is treasured by the king as his own kin. But how could it simply vanish? The Bishwi beast is treasured by the king as his own kin.
It has lingered for you for too long. It's yours now. My journey of life. A fleeting dream.
see? I'm over here. I found the fan. Look. Mother left her fan before she went away. She must have felt torn between her son and husband. But this iron ball, it just won't stop. Now that you are here, help me drive it away, and I'll let the fan do its work. Hey, Fox, how can you be sure it's even real? Rest assured, Mother taught me this spell. Only the real fan will answer it. The bull sounds weak, probably on his last legs. Guess I have to trust you once. I'll get down there and stop the ball and let you do your work. Skin will protect him. Come on, let's save Father first.
things are not clear for me. Are you still in the haze of what, you wicked lad? Mm. Our lady asked us to guard this place, not to check another face. Kill whoever breaks in was the order. By your word! <laughs>
This child be born, but he never knew my struggles. <sighs> How can we but follow the master's word? Rakshasi, you know it was he who made you drink from the river of childbearing. Shut it. You shall never speak of it. The king knows why I had to drink it. But I haven't glimpsed him ever since then. He made it another reason for his absence. Rakshasi, your husband shirks a dishonor this way. He granted you this cave with his Mount Bishwe beast as its sentinel. He's compromised enough for the sake of our master. You will seal your lips on this. Our family would be doomed if anyone knew the truth behind this child. Fear not. Master bids me aid you in secret. You and the bull, you will rear this child to manhood. And when the boy comes of age, well, on that day, he will be living proof of the dark deeds of Mount Lingshan.
Father, I brought him here. It's the destined one. Brother is not around. You can hand it over to him now. Brother will surely give up on his plan once it's returned. And then we will be a family again. You mischievous monkey. You dare to push your luck, but always have a way out. Are you not thinking straight, Father? I brought the Destined One here to save you! I may be unwell, but I am not blind. You are not my daughter. How can you say that to me? I went through flames to find the Destined One for you. For you, Father, don't you see? out if it's true after I hunt her down. But first, I should burn you two together and mix your ashes to honor your friendship. Entertainment. That can wait.
is after blood! <laughs> Thank 
thanks to this fool's death talisman. Poor Keeper. Seems his legacy was his only offer after all. No wonder not a single raindrop was fanned. It was your trick the whole time. <sighs> My bad, old wool. I was a bit delayed. You little rascal. I'll teach you a lesson on your parents' behalf. Holding on, despite it all. Does your vengeance weigh more than your family? It's 
spit it out now, his relic! <laughs> My king, I'm sorry for my lateness. I turned to them, but none offered help. My lady, forget it. I implore you to show mercy and spare my son. He is the last of the Yaksha's bloodline in the West with an origin most tragic and twisted. Now, he poses a threat no more. Should you grant him mercy, I, Rakshasi, and the Balking shall retreat ourselves to secluded meditation. Along with our children, we will never leave the mountain again. He is our son. We will bear his punishment. If it pleases you, my plantain fan is also yours to take. Flames have paved my way. Through flames, I shan't stray. Vain was my flame, for revenge destined to stray. Their delight lies in our submission, kneeling and begging. You've atoned through deeds, Black Bear. Take this pair of eyes. You've served the righteous cause, Yellow Rat. These ears are yours. Your power has gathered anew, Yellow Rat. Keep this nose. You've endured hardships and the eye. Go with the town. And the bull, it is the hardest to turn against a sworn brother. You can have his body. <laughs> the 
electric ball. Your luck plagues you every step. <laughs> Never have you made a good choice. is plain, just like my own. They forced me to drink from the river of childbearing, to bear that boy in my womb. If not for that monkey, we could have lived our separate lives in peace. As if none of this had happened. You're cute. You knew who I was from the start. Why do you choose to be their lapdog? I never wanted to sever our ties. If kinship means anything to you, give me that relic. Then let me avenge my people. Steer clear 
Yakshas are the mightiest of the eight legions, after all. Be your body hard as metal, meeting death in scores is inevitable. Yet, why did you endure the fish and those carts just as poorly? <laughs> you rush like wind with a clouded mind. It's your desires that shape what you see. Had your mind been less unsettled, would you still have fallen for that child's play? Haste oft blinds while patience illumines. Next time, can you still fulfill as Wukong without budging?